What's good, y'all? It's Coffee. Tapping back in with another one, guys. And you know we blog it all on this channel, so let's get right into it. So this is a this is a big change in my life. I'm just happy to be present with all of these beautiful people in here. You know, I want to thank Vivica Fox for wearing that dress too. Um, the love that I had for him, and still to this day, um, will always like he was the love of my life. I will admit that without any reservations. Um, he will always have a very special place in my heart. Um, but the reason why the re relationship um, ended was because we just went public way too fast, had way too many people in our business. And if I was to have a chance to do it over, it would be that we stayed private um, a lot longer. But we got too many people in our business and, you know, that's what all right, so you guys see those clips, right? I'm sure everyone remembers 50 Cent back at the BET Awards when, you know, he was really blowing up in the rap game, really getting that momentum going behind his career. He shot his shot with Vivica Fox, you know what I mean? And real quick side conversation, you feel me? Um, I, I'm no relationship guru or anything like that, but I just wanted to say in life, right, uh, you know, if there's some uh, girl out there you're in love with or vice versa, women with dudes or or whatever the case may be, you know what I mean? You should let that person know. Once again, I'm not a relationship guru, but I I'm sure a lot of people will agree like you got to put it out there into the atmosphere. You know, you don't want to uh, regret not speaking out if there was someone like you were having chemistry with or whatever the case may be. I don't know. Y'all can comment. And let me know if you guys agree or whatnot. You feel me? We just had to tap in on that as we're speaking on the situation. You know, life's too short. There's a lot of people out there in unhappy relationships just staying in it because they feel like they got to be in a relationship or whatever the case may be. I don't know. Tap in. Let me know what y'all think. But anyways, Vivica Fox, you know what I'm saying? As you, you heard the clip of her on Vlad TV, like that was it. Her and Fifth were, were uh, a couple after that. And... It's wild, like the, the news cycle is really picking this story up and going off the chain with it. Like they are very uh, infatuated with this story, I guess we could say. And it's kind of wild, you know, to hear Vivica Fox say that, though, um, that Fifth was like the love of her life. And because they went public, that killed the relationship. I mean, I'm not famous, so I don't know what that must be like. Paparazzi snapping pictures and you know the rumor mills and all that i don't know but it's kind of wild to hear her say that because if y'all remember um she she went on that one talk show and says some things about fifth said he was a little suspect you know what i mean and i'm sure uh everyone remembers too the way spider loke was getting at him on the get my loke on track uh uncle murder clowned on him on the yearly wrap up based on those comments that vivica, vivica fox made so it's kind of wild to hear her speaking about all this right now, right? Like, I guess it's really like a love-hate relationship or I don't know, like tap in and comment. But another quick side conversation, man, Vivica Fox has been in a lot of great films, man. Kill Bill, Set It Off, Booty Call, Soul Food, like hit the comments with all your favorite uh, Vivica Fox movies. She's also a beautiful woman beautiful woman very beautiful but uh you know what blew my mind when i saw this uh for all the the movie heads the film buffs out there i didn't realize she was in uh one of the sharknado movies i believe it's sharknado 2 and uh real quick guys comment i like and, and let me know if we should do a sharknado video as i let y'all know i like to blog on tv shows movies and whatnot like how did sharknado become this phenomenon that it is you know i uh, like uh, it's got a cult following and i see that a, a, a shitload of like famous people have been in all the different movies but i feel like when it started out it was just a low budget movie i, I didn't like did it catch on like that originally i don't know but tap in comment let me know if you you feel like we should do a shark nato movie and what's your favorite vivica fox films set it off wifey loves that movie great movie me and her you know watch it at least a couple times a year together but moving on with the way uh, the media is really picking this up with their highlighting heavily is that 50 Cent's current girlfriend, 
Cuban link commented on this. It reacted to it. And all she did was put like, oh, like, I, I don't know. You know what I mean? Like, are they trying to insinuate that she's mad or or what? I don't know. But Fitz been with a lot of uh, different famous uh, females. Like, what is the deal with that, y'all? Do famous people really only date other famous people? I don't know. That, that's that got to be hard to make things work, right? Like the way Vivica Fox was saying when her and Fifth went public, it kind of killed things. Like it, it's because, you know what I'm saying? You're both being followed around by the media and you both have your own careers going. Like I feel like if a famous person just were to ma marry a regular person, shit would be cool. But then I don't know. A lot of times we see if that does happen, the regular person kind of tries to get into the paparazzi and is seeking fame themselves. So I guess you got to find someone who ain't famous and don't want to be famous. You know what I mean? I don't know. Like if if I, I, I'm married, you feel me? You know what I mean? In a relationship for a long time. But if I was single and I like there was a, a famous woman and we got together, I feel like I could stay in the cut. I don't know. Let me know if y'all could. But anyways, like I said, we blog on everything over here on the J Coffee Talk channel. We cover a lot of different topics. Not the not the typical thing that I would pick up. You know what I'm saying is it's like some relationship stuff or whatever, which not that I'm against talking about relationships or whatever, but I just kind of felt like this was uh, newsworthy that I wanted to cover it as far as like you go back, um, you know, for the hip hop fans and fans of movies and pop culture and things like that. I'm sure everyone remembers that very well on the timeline, you know, 50 Cent blows up get rich or die trying does crazy numbers. You know what I'm saying? He hollers at Vivica Fox in the uh you know at the bet awards they end up dating then if y'all remember when the games uh documentary dropped he said yo anything is possible if 50 smash vivica <laughs> you know what i mean like it, it became a reoccurring thing in in music and in hip-hop but like i said at some point it seems like things went bad or something like that because uh you know uh, vivica fox has spoke out on numerous occasions kind of taking shots at 50 and once again she said that things about him uh you know which which in turn spider loke and and uncle murder were roasting 50 cent but uh that was just a couple years ago which was over a decade after they've been together so it's kind of like it's a love hate thing you know what i mean like i don't know i feel like that's why the media is running wild with this because they're trying to make it look like uh 50 cents current girlfriend is feeling some kind of way but that's all i really got on this one guys you feel me hit them comments once again life's too short shoot your shot you know with with that special someone out there you know what i mean don't be regretting it down the road later in life you know what i'm saying um what do y'all think about this whole mess with vivica and fifth and for those who watch that once again that's just a clip of the vlad tv interview if y'all seen the whole thing in its entirety tap in maybe you could shine more light on the uh, discussion here and um sharknado sharknado should we do a sharknado uh movie or i'm sorry video and what's your favorite vivica fox um you know movie she been in let's discuss it all below hit them comments yo did it 50 cent he used to mess with sierra too who's now russell wilson's wife future's baby mom and used to date bow wow right Man, it's it's crazy out there uh, in the celebrity world, man. Everyone be getting with each other's exes and whatnot. Man, I don't know. Let's talk about it below. Sub to the channel. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.